All right, we're into the second battle now with the Toxic team, and this team is relatively scary. There is a Seer Knight, which... Is that bad? Not really. It can't hit any of my Illumium super effectively. Protagon's scary, but I got Copademic to outspeed, so I kind of got to bring that. This thing is a lot of trouble. That thing's a lot of trouble. It definitely, that is probably going to be one of the toughest limits to be. Also, Venolin is going to be bad. Venolin is a problem. I want to bring Snagoot for the Harvest set. Looks pretty good for that. Not for the Wind Tricks, though, so I'll bring this thing for the Wind Tricks. I'll bring this thing for the Wind Tricks, actually. Plus, for the Protagon and the Seer Knight. Yeah, it's, just, it's good against everything, basically. Walk for Barblast. Which one of the Fluff Brothers should I bring? I think Barblast is the best option, because I think it has the best bolt. Best bolt and best attack. So it's just toxic. Okay, so he leads off with the Harvest Set. I'm going to throw a Poison out into the universe. If he goes into Ventolin, doesn't matter. Cos that's amazing, actually, because I actually run what Toxic is. I think he, I know, I think I know what he's doing. I throw a poison on it, which is nice. I don't know how I'm going to beat Cosmior. Cosmior is going to be one of the toughest. Lumion's the beat, because he's bulky as heck. I'm going to throw a Parasitize, though, in the universe. It literally just soaks the hit. It does nothing. Yeah, I don't think I beat this. And it's health amulet. Yeah, about that. This thing beats me, so about that. I don't go for a wait. Let the poison kind of stall it down a bit, but if he slumbers, it's basically over. He has been a haste. So, if he has been a haste, he probably... Okay, so if he has been a haste, he probably doesn't have that move then, if he has that. Let's go for parasitize. He does have slumber. Then what move does he have? What move is he missing? Yeah, I can't be. I basically can't be Cosmiar. I don't know what to do. Actually, I have an idea. So there I go. We can. I have an idea. We can go into. This will, This is funny. Watch it. I'm gonna go into Snagoop. And I'm basically gonna get rid of his item. That's basically what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna get rid of his item. And then go into something else. He's fast asleep, I'm gonna barter his item away. If I know the volcanic ashes aren't the best item in the world, but you know what? I'm getting rid of that health amulet. Whether you like it or not, I'm getting rid of that health amulet. That's the only thing I can even do at this point. So now, all the help you get has to be from that. That's the only way you can get your health back. I still don't know how I'm gonna beat the Cosmere, though. But no health amulet, so it doesn't matter. Actually, you wake up this turn. You wake up this turn, so... I'm throwing a poison out there. I'm gonna throw a poison now, actually. Nope, you still get poisoned. Does Banner Haste end this turn? I don't think so. Banner Haste does end. To get rid of health amulet. To get rid of health amulet. I'm gonna throw my flask. Does literally nothing. He's going down to poison. I'm, I'm thinking a slumber is coming out. So I am actually gonna go into slumber because I am predicting a slumber coming through. I mean. That's basically the only thing I can really do. I mean, I gotta hope Swolder can three-shot him from here. Basically, I gotta hope I can three-shot him from here. Basically what I'm hoping for at this point. I don't think I'm even close to three-shotting him. Yeah, Slumber sucks. Slumber really sucks for a lot of reasons. Because it's just no way... I could plausibly get rid of it. Yeah, 
considering I brought all range attackers. If only I brought up for Jaws. I don't have it. Yeah, I run two moves, Poison and Barter. Cause the, uh... I originally had Poison Barbs on it, but that didn't come from the light of day. I'm just going to keep attacking it at this point, because at this rate, it's literally just a lost cause. In a haste? Yeah. Well, yeah, I'm dead now, basically. Yeah, I'm basically dead now. Especially if you have Cerebral Flash in your, in your arsenal. Nope, you just have Meteor Crash. Wow, Swolder Live! Swolder Live? Wow, Swolder Live that. You'd love to see it. Swolder's bulky. Swolder very bulky. I wish I ran very brawny. I wish I ran very brawny Swolder. Boy, you wish you could run very brawny. I cannot believe it does not have the mind move. Yeah, this sucks. <laughs> I have nothing to set up. Our blast come in, I guess. Yeah, toxic blast. I love that hit though. I love at least one. Oh, I crit it. I crit it. Oh my gosh, our blast might have just saved my game there. Never mind, wind trick. Wind trick tops on in. Wind trick tops on in and says hi. Just tie there. I'm gonna do this. Go into Benelin. Don't have peace of mind. Peace of mind. Jeez. Fan of haste send it, which hurts me. Poison. I basically have to throw a poison. Basically the only thing I can really do. Watch Wintrick step for both. No, he swapped and he threw that low. Alright, five minute battle. I've lost Swolder, so it's basically just going to be a five-minute battle of our Venolin. And actually, I don't want to... If I want him... If I want him to steal an item, I don't want it to steal a health amulet. So, let's make it steal Gobademic's item. You're going to barter. You're heavy shackles, I bet. And I'm, and I'm not losing my health amulet. He actually swapped, and who goes? Partagon? Hey, you love to see it. Spurgon hops on in. Get the melee attack boost. I'm gonna throw a buck blast out in the universe. I actually outspeed you. Didn't even do half your health. Wow, didn't even do half your health. I'll do it again. He swaps. He goes to the Venolin. Yeah, I can't be Venolin now, unless Bar Blast. Did Barblast even beat Venolin? I don't even know. I don't even know no. Uh no, I don't actually. Snagoop could, maybe. No, Snagoop can't even. Yeah, Snagoop loses. It's basically just gonna be an endless battle between Venolin v Venolin if he has his Juvenate. And if he has Charade, he wins basically Venolin. Much better. It does nothing to me. He might be offensive, actually. He might be offensive, Venolin. I'm gonna go for my spatter myself. Oh, darn it. He's, he's heavy shackles. He's heavy shackles. Knew it. I knew he was heavy shackles. Dang it! I knew he was heavy shackles. No, well, now Venolin is basically unbeatable, and I do not know what to do now. Uh, much better. He swapped, and who go? That stinks. That is that stinks a lot. Yeah, it's gonna be touch and go now. 
Yeah, he basically just pushed the earthquake. I have an idea, actually. No, I lost my item. I forgot I lost my item. No earthquake. No earthquake for you! No earthquake for you! Basically just going for an air blade because Fendelin exists. So, uh, you know, Fendelin exists. Exactly my point. Fendelin exists. So, you know. There's no point. Yeah, it does literally nothing. I am going to go for a rest, though, because... I feel like he is just going to rejuvenate. Yeah, I don't think I can beat Ventolin. Yeah, he waits out of turn. The only way I could possibly beat Ventolin is if I can get two crits in a row. Which, I don't think I can rely on that. When I can literally just go back into my own Ventolin. Yeah, and we're basically just stuck on endless loop here. That's an assault, does nothing. Yeah, this is basically... Basically... Ventolin... Walls each other. He swapped. I clicked twice, and that was amazing. Who did we go in for? Oh! Big mistake, man! Big, 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 big mistake! That's all I can say. Big, 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 big mistake. You goofed there. You goofed badly there. Uh... Is Gobadamic useful? Yes, it's for the Tardagon. For Speed Creek. The full poison type kind of toxic. Wish I had a mind type. To be fair, you did have a mind type to be fair, but a critical hit kind of saved me. A very toxic. Oh, dragging spores. Well, that only did 11 damage. Wow. Who comes in? Definitely <laughs> a second. Uh, okay. Well. I don't mind. Snagoop! I don't... Taking 11 damage on Snagoop while Harvest X poisoned, I don't care that much. If the Harvest X is stalled down, it doesn't matter. So, yeah. I definitely want to take... Yeah, he swapped. Don't go into Protogon. And he did go into Protogon. He did go into Protogon. That is not good. Health amulet's not good because I took his I took his health amulet. Fenelin? Yeah, this battle's gonna be 30 minutes. I might have to make this as a separate video because this is literally This literally is gonna be even longer than the you know, this is gonna be even longer than the Who's he going to? This harvest set. Again, though, his Harvest Deck doesn't really support off of it. Honestly, if he has Parasitize, he should be clicking it now. If he has Parasitize, he should be clicking it. Like, I know it's obvious. Snagoop is basically the only swap. Though he still does get baited by the Earthquake. He still, he still does get jabated. I am going to actually go for a... Buck Black this time predicting Protagon. But I think he's just gonna go Ventolin. We're basically stuck in Ventolin the Ventolin, basically. You get a crit which does absolutely nothing, because <laughs> it's Ventolin. I have to say, your team is kinda toxic. <laughs> yeah. Very toxic. Yeah, very toxic. In a lot of directions. Yeah, my team is very toxic. That's literally going to be the thumbnail. Very toxic. I gotta get a rest off. There's no doubt about that. I gotta get a rest off. I feel like Gobademic isn't that useful. I feel like I should throw Gobademic away. Is throwing Gobademic away good? I think I will actually throw Gobademic away. I think I will. It would be nice for the Protagon, but I do not want Snagoop getting hit. I do not want Snagoop getting hit. So, yeah, about that. And the thing that's good is Harvestex getting absolutely chipped. Swaps out again. 
Yeah, he's just playing it safe with Ventolin. He's playing it absolutely safe with Ventolin. I, I physically am just unable to beat Ventolin. Because I lost my Swolder at the start to that Cosmiar. So, I'm just physically unable to beat Ventolin no matter what I do. The best I can do is draw. The best I can do is draw. That's the best I can do. And honestly, if I draw, I will count that as a win. He does for a much fatter. He's trying to get me down low on health. I, I really want to predict that Harvest deck, though. I want to predict that Harvest deck badly. I will actually go for our kill this time. Problem is, if Harvest deck comes in, he can probably beat me. Let's see. Yeah, if Harvest Deck comes in, he could probably beat me now. He did. Oh no, he went he went Protogon, actually. Did not think he was gonna do that. I think he predicted me to use Adaptive Assault again, predicting his other Harvest Deck. Back up full health, I'll take that. Blood Spatter. And now I'm stuck into Rejuvenate. That's fun. I'm stuck into Rejuvenate. I'm just gonna go for Rest then. I'm stuck into Rejuvenate. So, yeah, that ain't good. I wish I went for much fatter. So, do I just stay in to rejuvenate here? That's interesting. I will stay in to rejuvenate, actually. I will stay in to rejuvenate. So, Deja Vu will eventually run out. Problem is, that basically gives the Harvest Deck a free turn to go in. Um, and since I'm Heavy Shackles... And since I'm Heavy Shackles... Actually, I have an idea. Let's run a Bar Blast. It's going to be a ballsy play, but let's see if I can make this work. Went for Soul Storm. I love the hit. And the Poison actually does take it out. Barblast is still alive. He is actually still alive in this battle. Protagon comes back in. Protagon comes back in. He only gets a melee boost. And we are both down to our last three Illumions. We are both down to our last three. I'm going back into Venolin. So I think Barblast could be good later in the match. I don't know if he has anything I can outspeed, though. Thunder Strike? Okay. I just don't know if there's any way I could beat the Ventolin. That's the thing. He swapped in the Ventolin? Ventolin? Yeah, I just don't think there's any possible way I could beat Ventolin. No matter what I no matter what I do. I wish I brought something like a blow top. So we're just stuck in an endless loop. This would be a good time for a rejuvenate though. Of course he crit. Why can't I get a crit? Is beyond me, but you know. Why can't I get a crit is beyond me. It's that protagon with deja vu, which is mainly the scary thing. Because I could get absolutely decimated from that protagon. That protagon can still absolutely decimate can still absolutely decimate. I feel like he's gonna go into Partagon now. He did not. Wow. Did he just rejuvenate? Nope, he's just spattering. Can you stop? Can you just stop now with the crit? You know you don't have to crit me. It's not fun when you do that. And he went into Partagon. So yeah, Barblast is basically useless now. He's basically useless now because he's just gonna... Is being stuck in a rejuvenate the worst, honestly? Honestly, it might not be. Let's see. Honestly, it's not the worst getting stuck in a rejuvenate. Because Protagon can't touch me. That's the thing. Protagon can't touch me. He swapped out, but... Yeah, that there, there's where he wins the game, right there. There's where he wins the game. This thing, that's how he wins the game. Go to Bar Blast and just threaten this thing out. 
going to barb off and threaten this thing. So he can't just peace of mind spam. So yeah. That means you have to attack me this turn, or otherwise it won't work. He has to attack me. He does. Don't be glide. To be fair, it won't matter. He outspeeds my entire team. Doesn't matter, he outspeeds my entire team. So I'm gonna throw poison out there. Fuck out. Ventolin from that. Yeah, there's literally no way I can do Ventolin, so I think I'm gonna have to call this a draw. Like, I eventually he could beat me, but I think I'm gonna have to forfeit because it's physically impossible for our Ventolin to go down. Unless we unless we get five hundred crits in a row. It's basically physically impossible for our Ventolin to take each other out. So despite this being the second battle, I might have to keep this one of the video because this is literally lasting forever and it's just ridiculous. This is just getting ridiculous at this point. I mean, it's not even fair anymore. Like, we literally can't take each other out. He went rejuvenate. It, it, it's basically... It basically is impossible. It's basically impossible. Yeah, we're both back at full health, so we're gonna call this... We're basically just gonna call it from here. Swap. Oh, never mind. Well, I got rid of Protagon, but that's nice. Got rid of Protagon. Get rid of... Or, close to. Be close to getting rid of him. Very close to. Not the best play from him. Deja vu me. Actually... It would be smart, actually, if he deja vu's me. Actually, never mind. It's, I might actually lose here. Because he deja vu me into... He deja vu me into Mud Spatter. And I'm too low for... Yeah. He might have might just won. He might have just won. Now do come in. And what do I do now? I basically just gotta throw poison on the wood trick. That's basically all I can really do. Or I can muck blast, but I think I'm gonna throw poison. Don't miss. I got the hit at least. But he one shots me, so you know. He one shots me. Yeah. Although the wind trick does take damage, so that's fine. Wind trick takes damage. Protagon is dead. I'm gonna go for a wait because I know that one trick is a nightmare. So yeah, about that. I gotta play my card correctly. He's trying to get the critical hit. I could actually go for another wait here and feel very good about it. Let's do that. Let's go for another wait. He rested this turn. I could have went for a rest myself, but you know what? I don't. I, it doesn't matter. I just want. Yeah, he's he's going down to poison pretty much. Going down to poison. We go for a rejuvenate this turn because I kind of have to. Goes for a peace of mind now, which is scary. Goes for a peace of mind. I basically am forced to hit it. Yeah, I think I'm gonna hit it this turn because I think it goes down. And then we basically are stuck with two ventilins. And so yeah, we're gonna be stuck with two ventilins basically. Unless he crits me. Which he doesn't. We're stuck with two Ventolins now. <laughs> we're stuck with two Ventolins. Unless Mud Spatter crits me, we're stuck with two Ventolins. For forever, and ever, and ever, and ever. We're basically stuck now. It's basically a soft lock. Yep, it's basically a soft lock now. <laughs> welcome to Ven- Welcome to Ventolin. Welcome to Ventolin. We basically are now stuck in an infinite loop where nothing happens. Yep, because now he's running out of energy, so I just, I just rejuvenate. If only one of us had charade. If only...
Yeah, I'm gonna forfeit, because this is literally impossible. Hope you guys enjoyed this battle. Well, probably not. It's just two Venelins. So, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed this battle, and I'll see y'all all later. Bye-bye!